What's going on guys? This is Trey Mathis here from wifeentrepreneur.com. So glad you guys landed here on my page today. It's a beautiful day here in Martha's Vineyard. Let's see if we can get you guys some shots. There it is. My wife has me in my warmy warm hat. It's beautiful. A little snow fell on the beach last night, so we want to come out and check it out. talk with you guys really quickly about what's been going on. This is the Wi-Fi Journal. Hey guys, if this is your first time checking us out, this is on Facebook. Make sure you subscribe to our Facebook page. If this is on YouTube, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. Gotta be honest, this is kind of a last minute video I'm throwing together here for you guys. But normally, we talk each and every day about personal development, about affiliate marketing, about how to create an online brand, turn your passion into profit. Uh, today, my wife and I, we were, like I said, just out hanging out here in Lucy, um, Lucy Vincent Beach. It's one of the beautiful beaches here at uh, Martha's Vineyard. I was just shooting some drone footage Pretty sure you guys will see that on the social media channels. And uh, I just got told to put my drone down by somebody. As you can see, it's no one on this beach. And what's quite interesting about Martha's Vineyard is, is normally Martha's Vineyard is a very busy place in the summertime. The peak season is, you know, like July, August, and September. But it's a real great place to come year round. And we was out here and Hanging out with the dog, as you see, off leash, and just ran into somebody on the beach. They were out walking their dog as well, and uh, trying to get the footage right. I don't have my selfie sticks. So I have to hold it. Always be prepared. So, out walking on the beach, the other person came by walking on the beach. Now this place is a no dogs doing. That's what the sign says right out front. However, in the winter time, a lot of rules are taken laxed, if you will. And you can take it how you want. I took it kind of weird at first. I feel like rules should be followed all, all year. <laughs> there shouldn't be a time where you can break the rules anywhere. But anyway, that's just me. However, my in-laws and everyone else like, oh, you know, my opinion is real lax. You can just come out here and do whatever uh, in the winter time. And some rules are taken very lightly. Find the last where I got walking on the beach and flying the drone. Another person walks up, comes along, they were walking their dog. Dog was running off leash and met pumpkin. It was all good, no problems. And by the time the lady comes up to us, she she comes over to me and she says, you know you can't have that here. So first thing I'm thinking is that I know she's talking about the drone, but I'm like she can't you can't have that here because uh it's a rule against it. Now, what's interesting about this is, is this individual is telling me it's a rule against me flying my drone. However, it's listed right on the door, right on the entrance to the beach, that it's against the rule to have a dog on the beach. And it's against the rule to have a dog off leash just about anywhere on the island. So not only is this person breaking two rules themselves, they're gonna tell me what rules I'm breaking. Now, why am I telling you this story? Not because I'm mad because she told me to take down the drone, because I'm not. I got tons of footage, I already killed one battery. Not that she messed up this beautiful beach day, as you can see, still can't see anyone around. So I'm having a great time and I want to talk with you guys. So that's not why I'm telling you this story. But what I am saying, telling you this story is, if you want, if you want to tell someone what to do, I have to suggest someone something to someone about what to do. You have to be a person of integrity first. You have to one be walking in a in a step that says, "Look, not only am I suggesting you guys what to do, or to, suggesting to you what to do, I'm telling you because it's the right thing to do. I don't break the rules, so I'm telling you not to break the rules." However, if you're around breaking the rules yourself and then telling someone else not to break the rules while you're breaking the rules. And you're not a person of integrity. No one should take you seriously. And that's the same thing when it comes to like having a YouTube channel. I feel like the people who are doing 
the things that they're talking about, who are actually out there sharing with you guys and growing with you guys step by step, they deserve your time and attention because those people are of integrity. They're doing the necessary and they're doing it and they're saying, look, if you do it too, you're gonna have success. And that's what I'm saying, you know, if that person was not breaking the rules, that person was not here with their dog, and that person said, hey, you're breaking the rules because you're flying your drone. I could say to myself, whoa, you know, here's this person out here doing the right thing, and I'm disrespecting that person from, for, I'm disrespecting that person for, you know, not following the rules in which they have taken the time to follow. Well, on the flip side, if they are breaking the rules and they're telling me I shouldn't be breaking the rules, then I can't necessarily take that person too seriously. So, um, be a person of integrity. This is the moral of the story. Hope you guys uh, enjoyed this little beach walk with me. I'm going to get back to my family now. Uh, if you guys know anyone who wants to create an online brand, that person of, of integrity has integrity. Uh, by all means, tell them about our page, wifientrepreneur.com. We want to help them turn their passion to profit. So until we talk again, hopefully we'll see you inside the community. We have over a million entrepreneurs. Uh, it's free to get started. If you're not already joined, click the link below. Until we talk again, take care and be blessed. Peace.